was browsing on the internet and I saw this wonderful website which could help you a lot. It could change your CWA into GPA in just a short moment, right? So let me show you an evidence to show you that this website is very authentic. So this is an evidence to show you. So I just did one, which um, it was very easy for me to do. So this is one thing I did, okay? So this is this, and then after calculating, the GPA that was given to me was what? 3.786. So what I did was to... Um, write all the courses that i did from first year to third year i mean fourth year now and then give all the marks that i had and the credit hours and then this website what did it do for me it just converted in my cwa into what gpa in a short moment right so look at this it's very wonderful and you could see it that the gpa cumulative gpa is 3.786 and this is not actually my CWA. It is actually not my GPA. Actually, I forged some. Okay, it's a forged. So I'm going to teach you how you can do that. And then, if you're in KNUST or other university that use CWA, then you have the right spot to change your CWA into GPA. So let's get into it. So now, let's move on. So the website is called Scholar, right? This is Scholar, but we have a lot of Scholar. So please pay attention to this video. And after watching this video, kindly go on the description of this video to check for the link that you can use to do this. So now let's get started. You go to get started. When you go to get started, we have Scholar Premium, right? And this, they say that one report is what? Zero dollars. So let me see that if you change it, you can change it. So it's one report is what? zero dollars right so with this it comes it comes with free payment okay so then you move to what next and when you go to next the next thing you are supposed to do is that you're supposed to log in with your what your email address um what i would advise you is that if you have several email address you could use any of them to do it because this is for one email so when you have one email and you want to check again you need to have a different email so i'm going to choose a different email which is um so guys this is my email golden silver k20 the password um i would love google to generate a password for me so generate the password and it has generated a password for me so what i want to go is to create scholar account so after creating the scholar account what is next to do they are going to ask of payment but this is the case that it is free so then i'm going to submit what order because it's free for one report submit order so after submitting order what it does is that it's going to move on to the next page for me to start the login so this is the uh, interface after doing the order so what you need to do is that you just go to what create what gp create gp report so you go to create gp report and then after getting to create gp report this is very crucial when filling this form please take your time this is your full name which should be your full name okay and um, this is your report title you can just write gpa report gpa report okay so gpa report then your date of birth is very important because this actually when you're applying for grad school you could add it to it as um a support document to it so you need to put in your what correct um date of birth but i'm going to just for some date of birth uh, which is um 9th may uh, 2000 okay and then when you come here select great with this you select nothing don't select anything because there's nothing here okay so the next thing you do is that select institution so the institution is the institution you are in so i mean Kwame Nkrumah university of science and technology Kwame Nkrumah so Kwame Nkrumah university of science and technology so as you can see that's come Kwame Nkrumah university of science and technology and then i'm doing my bachelor's so just write bachelor's right bachelor degree bachelor degree okay so bachelor degree okay so you are having a bachelor degree and then recommended is no i don't recommend that then you come to with this the grading skill you come to all okay when you come to all then you choose knust now in this case if you're a medical student we have different way so we have two knust here be careful we have knust for the normal colleges and the knust for what 
the medicine school of medicine uh, medicine and dentistry so you choose i'm doing engineering so i'll choose KNUST here and what you do now is see how when you come down here this is very important with this side you are going to um put in your courses that you did from first semester level 100 to your recent year so if me i'm in fourth year but my first semester fourth year result has not come in so i'm going to use from first semester first year to second semester third year do now is that after you've chosen the k university then what you do now is that here the courses that you are doing and the credit hour and the grade okay so for instance maybe you did um com skills which is com skills right so com skills com skills and what you do now is that you put in the credit hour so maybe it's two credits hour and the grade that you had is what grade a in capital letters now if you want to add you just add if you want to add the number of you can add um add uh, maybe three rows at the same time with add then you fill in everything from maybe where you are from first year to maybe fourth year you fill you fill in with all your results easy way to do this to open your aim up right beside you and then you put in everything inside and after you put in everything what i'll tell you is that you just come here and just write what calculate what gpa it will calculate for you and then you come to what create gpa report after creating a gpa report this is how it will be like so this is a gpa report when you the website will send you the what the report as a pdf then you download it right and then after that it's going to calculate what your gpa for you which is what very easily this is seven three point seven eight six and it is from green university you can see that it is from the grade point from green university um grading scale right so this is how you can do your calculate your cwa in an easy way thank you very much for watching